Each year members of the royal family undertake engagements focused on the armed forces commemorating those who have died in world wars and other conflicts. This year, events were led by the king for the first time following his accession. The Prince of Wales was the second person to lay a wreath at the cenotaph, which bore the feathers of the heir apparent. Solemn Princess Royal lays a wreath at the cenotaph during service. Princess Anne has made a poignant tribute to the armed forces on her first Remembrance Sunday since the death of Queen Elizabeth II. Prime Minister Rishi Sunak, leaders of opposition political parties, senior ministers, and faith representatives also laid wreaths during the ceremony on Whitehall in central London, which was lined by thousands of members of the public. The ceremony was also attended by seven former prime ministers, including Liz Truss and Boris Johnson. Many veterans arrived either in uniform or proudly wearing their service medals on their chest, alongside ordinary members of the public. After the two minutes of prayer and reflection had ended, in an emotional tribute to those killed during the wars of the last century, members of the military played the last post. The Queen Consort, Camilla, and Princess of Wales, Kate Middleton, and Countess of Wessex, Sophie, were also present.